And so we return to the obelisk hunt. Where were we up to? I don't even remember what number we got up to before I found the mysterious slate. Uh, it was one of the ones up here. I don't know which one though. Why are you still marked? I think it might have been this one that we found it at. But did I finish the obelisk is the question. I think I did. Didn't I? <coughs> Too far away, I can't see. Yes, we did that one in the end. Uh, and then there's one over here as well. Have I checked this one? I don't know. Uh, this perfume feels familiar, so I feel like I have checked this one, but I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm lost. It's looking unlit to me. It's looking lit to me. <laughs> We've done this one, damn it. Okay. That's those three. Okay, now for you five. There is... Why did they... This person's got a map marked with all the bloody pupa on it. It's like, can you give us a clean map? Are you going to give us a guide? Um... Tour underground. Well, that's not useful. Okay, well, let's just uh, go to these markings and find which ones are underground. I'm assuming we did the first obelisk, right? Be dumb if we didn't. And then just north of you is an obelisk. Don't know which ones are underground, so we're just gonna have to visit them all. Ah, yes, we did this one. Because it was down here. Right, we finished it. Yes, we finished that one. Thought so. There's another one here. That's the one I just did before. There is another one here, though. Is that underground? I don't fucking know. I wish this map would tell me which ones were the underground ones, but it does not. I feel like this has to be an underground one. But where are we going? We are going here ish. The map marking is terrible. <laughs> well, I don't really see much of anything here. Uh, I'm thinking this is one of the underground ones. Oh, dear God. Hmm. Yeah, this one I think I already did during the dirge quest line. I'm pretty sure we did this one during the dirge. Because we had to come back and I couldn't find it. I went down there, remember? But it was actually up here. Yeah? 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 Yes. Okay, so we've done that one. So the rest should all be on the surface then. So then the only one left is... Here. Oh, you can go away now. It's over here somewhere. Curses. There's sand in my shoes. Or is this one also underground? Oh, I don't know. This might be the, another underground one. Where am I heading exactly? Oh, down. Sorry, wrong direction this way. Way in the wrong direction. Let's start again and take the correct direction this time. I need to go south, not east. I have a feeling this is also underground. Oh, look, there it is. <laughs> well, I have to be missing an obelisk because I haven't got my achievement yet. So it has to be you, right? You're not near anything for me to have done already. <laughs> yes! Mark 
these bad boys. Yeah, I found you. If I could just mark you. All right, I'm on top of one. Where is it? Is it on the ground with the gin? Mm, no. No, it is not. Mm, is it in the wall? Mm, no. I thought you said I was standing on one. Oh, I thought I was over here. Why did I think I was over there? Oh, because it put me there and it was the center of my screen. That's why. I just assumed that it would put the center of the screen on me, but it did not. Okay, I understand now. <laughs> oh. The Vanut. <gasps> Hi, gentlemen. Looking for trouble? Uh, no, I'm looking for obelisks and stone slates. Here you are. It's like killing right there all over again. Think you're going to die, but we'll meet again. I'm so scared. Here now, all go. that aside, oh, there it is. Never mind, found what I was looking for. <sighs> so far north. Why did you be so freaking far away? It's not exactly fun to traverse the desert on foot, you know. The game doesn't see fit to give me a mount. Be very nice if I had a mount. Make life a lot easier. Ah, this camp I didn't go to earlier. Mm hmm. Leaving. I got what I needed. <laughs> this should be the last obelisk. This should be the last obelisk. This is way more interesting and more fun than the first time around with the, the 10 original obelisks. That was shit. I did not enjoy myself at all. This is actually not so bad. I, I quite enjoy Finally, this. Some target practice. It's, it's not as difficult to find the pieces like it was with the originals. Shit. I'm putting you near the sump of these. See, it's sort of me. You could be in the right <sighs> angle to see these things. I always miss them. Oh god, we're going past the Sumter Beast anyway. It's decided to just sit down. Awesome.
Hill gels have it, you say? Uh, where exactly do the hill gels have it? Ah. One had to be violent to find them. I have them all! you covering anyway I got them all I want my reward plate uh, uh, can you please not mount the obelisk I'll hate them that went fire very quickly I couldn't even read it I was trying to struggle over the language here you go that's it that's all ten Woo! The name of the city's past, the murals within the temple of Gurubad speak of a glorious bygone age. Still need more context for Lilipa's business. Pavezravan Kwara. Khra, khrawara. Bring all the primal obelisks in the desert of Hadramaveth back to life. Yay! I'm kicking butt. Yay, I'm progressing so much this time. I'm making good time too. This is wonderful. Okay, let's go back here. One, because this guy needs some goddamn healing, and two, because we finally get to do Jet's Quest after I eat. Funny how uh, eating is a thing that you have to do so goddamn frequently. So I, so I'll do this. Hmm? Do, do, do you not wish to heal? Have I used too many of your healing magics? Thank you. I don't know why that was an arduous task. Uh, okay, Jet, I will be with you shortly, my dear. So Jet, I hope your wild quest doesn't take a, a very, very, very long time. I'm expecting something short and snappy, please. Short and snappy. Because I haven't playing a lot of Genshin. And I'd like to stop playing Genshin if it's all the same with you. <laughs> because I'm going to have to play it in a few days to get through the, uh, the Lantern Rite. By God, that's going to take a lot of time. Uh, Jet? Oh, she's inside now. How, how could I forget? I hope it's not too late. We should at least search around his tent. Jet, what's going on? Are you going somewhere? <clears throat> Pamela Linara, you came just in time. There's something I gotta do right now. I need to get to a Durfee's place. A Durfee had Bemben, didn't he? A Durfee. Isn't he that trader who made shady deals with the Fatui? Oh, Pamela knows. You wanna go see if there's any valuable stuff he left behind. No, I'm not interested in this stuff at all. The tribe has its own rules on dealing with the belongings of traitors like a Durfee. <laughs> if it wasn't if it weren't for the rules, I would no doubt burn everything down the first chance I get. I'm going to his tent because... Because of Benben, right? Oh, I know Benben's still over there at Durfee's place. Jet, why did you leave Benben with someone like him? I didn't know he was a traitor. Anyway, I need to check on Benben as soon as possible. Lenara, we should go with her. Let's get going right now. Yeah, Paman hopes Ben Ben's okay. Ben Ben Zish. Ah, I was a smidge too slow to press V. Rejoice with me for what was lost is now found. I've got very wordy quest titles. Ben. I'm surprised he didn't take him with him. Thought that would have been something he would have done. There's value there. And then he would be in the hands of Fatui currently. Look, it's Ben Ben. He's quivering. I'm glad a deaf he didn't take Ben Ben away. Or perhaps you could say that everything here looks exactly the same as before. Do you really think it overturned the matriarch and returned to his tent safe and sound? <laughs> what a self-absorbed idiot. But thanks to that, nothing bad happened to Ben Ben. You call it something bad? Oh, poor Ben Ben. What is wrong with him? Yeah, why is it lying on the ground? Anyway, what happened to Ben Ben? Everything seemed fine the last time we saw it. After leaving Khajni suit, Ben Ben, sorry, Khaj, Khajni suit, Ben Ben gradually grew weaker. It looked like its parts were malfunctioning and the sound of its beats were getting lower. Then it couldn't make any sounds or move at all. I felt as if it was watching its life slowly dry out. So its battery is dying? I guess, is it a proximity thing? It's getting further away from the mausoleum? 
I don't know. At the time, no one in the tribe knew what was going on with Bamban except Durfee. So how did he know what was going on? He's a merchant. He's not exactly trained in, you know, ancient mechanisms. So I left Bamban in his care. I know, is Bamban going to stay like this forever? <coughs> Sorry, I'm very mucusy. <coughs> I apologize. At the very least, Bamban's still here with us. I'm sure we'll find a way to fix it sooner or later. But there's nothing we can work with. Hmm, let me think. I remember a Durfee telling me that whatever's wrong with Ben Ben, it's nothing too serious, and that it should fi be fixed within a few days. Knowing him, if he performed some kind of investigation, he would have definitely left records behind. Let's have a look around the area. If it really was nothing too serious, maybe we can even try fixing Ben Ben ourselves. Okay. Read. It's published novels, though. Persina's Essays, 26. True knowledge is not something that can be drawn casually from the Akasha. Instead, the desert dwellers get a more comprehensive education during their long walks across the sands. You notice at the bottom of the title page has an Emma belonging to you. Okay, I'm pretty sure we read all these books. But I could be wrong. Sorry. It was dark on my table. I was trying to figure out what this, this object was. It's totally the bottle cap, but it's black on a black desk in a dark room. So I couldn't actually see what it was. <laughs> ah, that was an odd moment. I'm sorry. Look there. There's something over there. It doesn't look like investigation records to Paimon. It looks more like a letter. A letter? Let's open it up and see what's written inside. Oh, that's fun. Note regarding an exchange of goods. As per usual, our exchange will be carried out at the withered tree behind the mountain, and on the subject of Ben Ben, the special object inquired about previously, the problem does seem to be related to an inability to self-circulate due to a lack of energy. It just needs to be charged using energy obtained from elemental conversion, and its function should return. As for a receptacle for that conversion and charging process, there is no need to worry. We can hand something over as part of the deal. However, we hope that you could bring along the special object Ben Ben. Our researchers are quite interested in it, and it's could be used as reference material for our research. The letter says Ben Ben simply ran out of energy. I mean, that's what I said. Now that Paimon thinks about it, Ben Ben opened the gates to the mausoleum of King Deshret for us and activated our clearance. It really helped a lot during our journey. And even mechanical creatures like Ben Ben get tired. Maybe it ran low on energy after doing so much for us. The letter mentioned something called emergency transformation capacitors, but I didn't see anything like that in the tent. Could it be? It might be hidden somewhere. He might have never received them. I know what you mean, the transaction hasn't even taken place yet. Well, that's what I was figuring. A Durfee didn't bring Ben Ben to the transaction, so there shouldn't be any energy transformation capacitors here anyway. There's only one question left. Who did he strike the deal with? The Fatubi, obviously. That was a dumb question for me to ask. There's only one group outside of the tribe who have dealings with this. Sumeru researchers? The Fatubi. Precisely. Who else could it be? What should we do now? <laughs> what else? There's no negotiating with the Fatui. We go to the transaction site and steal the capacitors from them, but we don't know when the meeting was meant to take place. It could have already meant to have taken place and the Fatui could have left, or it could be like a month from now. Woohoo! Let's go steal it from them! But Ben Ben, we can't carry it with us in its current state, so we can't take it to the transaction site. It isn't safe to leave it alone either. I don't want to put it in a risky situation ever again. Why don't you just ask the matriarch if she can hold on to it? Paimon and the Nara will go raid the Fatui. Can just wait here with Ben Ben? Yeah, let's raid the Fatui! Yep, yep, this won't be our first time. And I dare say it won't be the last. I really want to go myself, but Lunara, Paimon, I'm counting on you to help Ben Ben recover. And even though they're just a bunch of Fatui, you should still be careful. Don't worry, just leave it to us. I don't really want to stay here in this traitor's tent with Ben Ben, though. I'll take it to my place. Let's meet up in my tent after you retrieve the capacities. But his tent is quicker to get to than yours is. Okay, head over to the location. Which should be somewhere over here, but it's not going to mark it for me. <sighs> I've got to find it myself. Fuck's sake. I don't exactly have anything to go on. It's generically up in the, the east. Like, wh what is that to go on? I have nothing to go on. It's something here. Something here, maybe? Back here? 
I don't know. I wish it would give me the opportunity to like compare the map and the note at the same time, but I can't. Nah, it doesn't look like it at all. It's definitely this side. I mean, these things are the only things that look like what it could be, no? This is the only thing it looks like. Those. See? Those things. So if my original supposition is correct, it means it's like here somewhere, right? I guess. <clears throat> I got one. And this is a, oh, this is the abandoned Fatui camp. We came by this earlier. Going to our map, this should be the place where the deal is going to take place. Doesn't look like there's anyone there now. Let's sit over there and wait for a while, shall we? <laughs> sit. Is he going to have marshmallows toasting by the campfire? Defeat the Fatui. Yum. No blinking, lady. Bad bear. Please stop. Please have mercy. We're gonna get killed if you keep this up. That is rather the point, sir. Wait, they're playing TCG behind me? Sure sounds convincing coming from the one who's been beaten. Talk! Spit it out! Yes. I'll tell you everything. Anything you want to know. How is it that they have this many corpulent Fatui members? Honestly, we come across a lot of them. Then start with what you know. We always had dealings with the Durfee, and it sounded like the matriarch of the Tanit had a bias for Azarik. And the new girl. I don't know why, but it seems like Azarik has gone missing too. He be dead. The woman is cruel. She considers everyone who's no longer of any valuable to the tribe an eyesore. So Durfee contacted us in order to maintain his status. Our business in the desert area never went according to plan until until we struck the deal with the Durfee. No longer of any value. What does that mean? I don't know. I really don't. That has nothing to do with the internal workings of the desert folks. But if I had to guess, it might have been because she thought we were no longer trustworthy. And so she began to keep her distance, and a Durfee, who had been in frequent contact with us, was very distressed because of that. After all, we can always leave this wretched place when needed. A Durfee, on the other hand, will be used, to be used by the tribe until he's no longer of value. His life is virtually in their hands. But he was extremely cunning. He somehow made us fulfill his every request, while we, on the other hand, never heard anything of the value... Sorry, never heard any of the items we were asked for. Well, what were you asking for? Can you share that information with me? And now the rumors say he's got himself in trouble. We weren't sure what happened exactly, but we saw it as a window of opportunity. An opportunity for what? We assumed that there wouldn't be many opportunities for us to trade with the Durfee in the future, so we asked him to bring the special primal construct he mentioned in his letters. If we could get a hold of that primal construct before we left this place for good, we would still have gained something. Huh, so you're here to steal stuff too? No wonder we couldn't find any goods or the energy transformation capacitors. Hold on, did you just say two? Yep, now hand over the capacitors. I don't tell Pam on the energy transformation capacitors are all made up. No, the energy transformation capacitors, how many times are you going to make me say that? Are very real, and there's a whole batch of them. They seem to be ancient relics, so I'm not sure if any of them are still functional. Tell us where these energy transformation capacitors are. Capacitors, keep up the imposing tone, Paimon. 
He <laughs> Pam and Will. Huh, Leonardo, change the subject. Speak up. Tell us what the capacitate. I keep wanting to say capacitators. I don't know why, because it's not even a word. The capacitors are. They're at a camp not far away from here. Here's the key to its entrance. I've told you everything I know. Then get moving. All right, all right, I make myself scarce. We have a Fatui stronghold key. Wow, he's literally just abandoning his people to my mercy. Wow. Didn't see that coming. Now, we didn't go too far in this direction. I did something over there. Yeah, that. And then I left. So I don't know what's down here. Ah, oh, what the heck? We're here. We may as well. Oh, okay. How much more do I have left over, actually? Oh, <laughs> we went down to 18 million. <laughs> so we went down, um, what, almost 3 million. Oh, there's a stronghold. Chakra swirl! Flicker. Hi, I knew there had to be more. See, I get stuck on the pincers that I can't zip around. I swear by my sword. Whirling snow. Here you go. <laughs> Eat it, but whatever. Ouchie. Alrighty. Into the Sumter Beast den. I'm about to get annihilated by Sumter Beasts. Oh, I hate these guys. Pet to ashes! Why didn't I thought hit him? There we go. Run from debt. I don't have any debt. I told you this yesterday. Excuse me. Looks like that's the spot. Let's get in there and look around. Sure, as long as I don't so die. My Here you are. Hmm. A process of elimination. I don't like the area of effect on this. I feel like it should center around him, but it doesn't. It centers on the front of where he's looking. Holy shit, son, you're a uh, damaged good. Whirling snow. There's not much further you can go up this piece of mountain work, sir. I need him, it didn't work. Oh, he just suddenly died? Don't know what he died from. He had plenty of health last time I saw his health bar. I guess this key is for the door? Open sesame! Looks like this is the energy transformation capacitor. The Vatui said there are a lot of them. There's only one. Collect a certain number. Collect a certain number. Oh, there's more that way. Sorry, I didn't see the other path. Casually set by to the place, you know, nothing important. Nah. Hello? What even is attacking me? Turn to Jet's tent. But 
there is a <laughs> Dendroculus here. Somewhere. Are these Sumter Beasts trying to kill me? Yes, they are. Hmm, there you are. Hiding. Crafty little thing. Curses. There's sand in my shoes. So, is there any energy in these capacitors? That is the first question we must ask. And do we know how to access the energy in these capacitors? Because I must tell you, Jet, I'm not familiar with these constructs. Up, uh, there we go. Jet, how was it? Did, you didn't get into trouble, right? Just a little bit. Everything went as smooth as it could. Look, we got the energy transformation capacitors. I have three of them. Huh, this is what energy transformation capacitors look like. But how are we supposed to use them? They said I didn't know. Oh, he's making noise. Ben Ben? Ben Ben connects to the energy transformation capacitors and quickly extracts them. Uh, yeah. Quickly con... It takes energy. I don't remember even the word they used. Oh my god. <sighs> we resurrected Ben. He wasn't dead. You can't resurrect something that's not dead, Paimon. I'm not dead yet. Silly Paimon, Ben Ben just woke up from a long nap, that's all. Hey, I wasn't worried. I need to recover no matter what. Hmph, I don't want to put it in a risky situation ever again. Don't parrot me, Paimon. Beep. Oh yeah, the no, Ben Ben says thank you. Even though Ben Ben was lying still without saying anything, it knows everything you've done. No need to thank me, Ben Ben. Beep. Mmm. Is there anything else the matter? Even though Ben Ben has woken up, it still looks like it could use some rest. Right, have a good rest, Ben Ben. Beep beep. Didn't even need a manual. Is that it? Are we done? Is that it for the desert? Ben Ben has recovered substantially. Things look pretty good right now. Because that was really, I mean, I know I said I wanted a nice, quick world quest jet, but I didn't mean that quick. That's a little excessively short. And it's you, back from Gurubad, eh? Ah, yes. Is this something you need? Things have been quite busy back here with the Tanit. Lirupa, she left and went back to that cursed place. Hmph. She was peacocking around the whole time, driving me up the wall, and now she's finally silent. What a relief. Still, she did help us a great deal. Come to think of it, what do you think she'll find there? And if there's nothing to be found, I wonder if she'll feel lonely. Like how we felt lonely. It's a shame that I couldn't go with you. Is that it? And when you have the time. Yeah, we'll talk about more when I have more time. Oh, right, right. It's nothing. If you're in any trouble, any danger at all, I'll be right back at your side. So, be careful. Yeah, I kind of feel like this is it. I feel like this is the end. This is this is the end of the desert. Um, um, it's been, it's done, I've, I've moved on. I don't think there are any other quests to do here. I'm happy to be wrong because I still don't understand the Falcon bullshit. I feel like we've just kind of left Lilu part to her own bloody devices, the poor dear. Not. Obviously we'll check back on a server reset because server reset is required for a lot of these things but hmm that seems to be it I don't like that revive Ben Ben to its former state hmm book learning alone That's is not enough really to cultivate intelligence all those scholars in the academia are prime examples I tuned out. I'm sorry, I'll hate them. I was trying to listen, but then I was busy thinking, should I Google to see if there's anything else? But I don't think there's anything else. Is there a point in Googling it? You know, I'm gonna Google it anyway. Well, as far as I can tell, that is the end for the Desert of Hadramavas. It's kind of sad. 
I kind of thought it would be more content. Yes, it's taken me a whole day and a half to get through the content, but don't forget some of that includes leveling up Malhatham and, and whatnot. There have been many but I still kind of thought there'd be more to it lately. than this. I guess. So I'll it's just disappointing have to how quick I was able to get through it all. Hmm. But yeah, that's that's all I I have. For the area, I don't have any other quests that I believe to be done. As I said, I will come back and check the tonight camps on the morrow. But I think that's it. I still feel really let down by the way the Falcon quest ended. I feel like that's just not complete. It feels really awkward and poorly written. And then the end of Lilo Pass, part of her quest line. Like, can we go visit her somewhere? Can we be present for her final showdown at a Gudabad? I don't know, because I don't actually know where she's physically gone. You know? She just yeeted, saying she's going back to Gurubad, and that's great, but it's like, I, I don't really have a Gurubad marked on the map. I can't just go to the old city. I've got ruins, but I don't actually have the city itself to go to, so... <sighs> I don't think there's anything alone, ever going to be fixed to that. To I think that, that's just it. I'm supposed All to accept the scholars in the that, that that's the end of it. Examples. But I don't accept it. Not even close. So, hmm. What is that? I guess next time I'm going to have to actually do this. <laughs> I don't know when I'm going to find time to do this because a new game comes out. So, I honestly don't know when I'm supposed to magically have time to play Genshin Impact and get through an entire lantern ride. <laughs> I don't know how it's possible. 84 wishes were almost at full pity for Dia when she arrives in 3.5. But that's March, so that's ages away.